Some teachers think that flipping the classroom means that they have to create a whole host of materials for students to watch at home. They couldn't be more wrong. Rather than spending hours of our valuable free time preparing even more materials, by flipping the classroom, we can actually save time. In this short video, we'll explore some of the ways we can incorporate flipped classroom techniques into our own teaching. This infographic highlights a whole host of possible approaches, all designed to develop our students' skills and, more importantly, help encourage deeper learning of specific topics. Let's start with video content. YouTube, in particular, contains videos on almost every topic imaginable, making it an ideal starting point. You could ask students to watch instructions, view excerpts, or even find their own content on a specific topic to share with others in the class. Setting specific internet search tasks can also help students discover useful background information. And by adding a compare and contrast style task, we can ensure they come to class preloaded with useful knowledge. Creating case studies, surveys, or even shopping for apps are all useful ways students can construct their own knowledge on a particular topic, which we can then further develop and deepen in class. Surveys in particular are a great way for finding out what students already know about a particular subject. This can then help us focus our delivery on what knowledge and understanding they need to develop most. Flipping the classroom can also help develop students' essential communication skills. Try asking them to read and review an article, create a Pinterest board, or even create a short visual presentation like this one. Whatever technique you choose to include, make it active. Students can then start your class by demonstrating their new learning, giving you more time to identify any gaps and add further stretch and challenge, ensuring everyone achieves their full potential.